So the spire, also known as the Monument of Light, or more affectionately, the Stiletto in the Ghetto, was built in 2002 to 2003. Um, it's located on O'Connell Street and it stands 398 feet tall and it is made of stainless steel and costs uh, 4 million euros to build. Um, the spire was designed by Ian Ritchie Architects who sought to build an elegant and dynamic, society, a dynamic simplicity bridging art and technology. Uh, the pattern around the base of the spire um, is based on a core sample of earth and rock formation taken from where the spire now stands. Uh, during the day, the spire maintains its stainless steel appearance, but at night, it is illuminated to become a beacon in the city night sky and across the city of Dublin. However, before the spire was here, um, there was another monument that held this particular spot, uh, and it was known as Nelson's Pillar. Um, the pillar was, until it was destroyed um, in 1990, or 1966. <laughs> Nelson's Pillar, or simply known as the Pillar, was a granite column topped with a statue of Horatio Nelson. It was built in 1808 to 1809 and was the first monument of Nelson built in the then United Kingdom. Despite the fact that many regarded the, the pillar as a symbol of oppression by the British government over the Irish people, it survived over 150 years even surviving the Easter Uprising of 1916, which took place largely on O'Connell Street. However, on the 8th of March, 1966, a strong explosion destroyed the top of the monument and sent the statue of Nelson crashing to the ground. The explosion was believed to be the work of the IRA or the Irish Republican Army, and although they denied their connection with the incident, um, they were still blamed for it largely. Uh, despite the strength of the explosion, there were no casualties and the minimal damage to the surrounding area. Oh. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs>